Welcome, 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 as we are about to get things underway here versus, sorry, as we have oh, the Oakville Ducks versus the Wiserhood out of British Columbia. And I will do my best, folks. Uh, this is game number two for me to get you the names of different players. Um, the Wiserhood will be a little bit tougher as things get on their way and the Oakville Ducks able to get control of that ball deep into the left corner and then back out towards the blue line. Uh, the Wiserhood will be tough to get names because although they input their roster, I don't have numbers associated with the specific names. However, the Ducks took care of business. Not there as the Wiser had 30 seconds in. Score. What an absolute bomb by the big guy in orange. I missed his number. And it should be a one to nothing lead here. However, Oakville tries to answer back quickly. What a start to this game, 30 seconds in. We have a goal and a minute in, we have icing. As I was saying, the Oakville Ducks got things done on the administrative side of things where I have names, numbers, positions. And I just have positions and names for Wiserhood out of BC. However, at the end of the day, administration doesn't matter. It's about points on the board, and the Wiserhood are up early and now on a three on two break and gets. Stopped fairly quick. That ball put deep. Aggressive play by the defenseman, keeping the duck off of that. Number 17, nice feed to the slot. Turn, shoots, no goal. No good as the Ducks still control the ball deep in their zone. Sorry, deep in the Wiserhood zone. And now the Wiserhood on the break. Track of the ball there as it comes down into play. Trying to find the cutting man across. As that comes back, could develop into something here for the Ducks if they are able to control it. Great passing here by the team out of Oakville, Ontario. Slap shots. Deflected. And dumped in by number 16, Michael Douglas. You see what I mean? I could see numbers. I could give you names. If I don't have the numbers associated with the names, I am lost. Great defensive effort. Up the field. Trying to get the number that laid out on the floor and then got up and busted his butt.
The Ducks get control of that. Quick dump and chase. However, tough bounce there. Ducks regain the ball. Dump it deep. Allowing for fresh legs to come into this game. Soft rolling pass to number, I think that was a 97. Black on black's a tough color combination. Number six is the goal scorer for Wiserhood. Getting an early 1-0 lead. 30 seconds into the game. My guy's not even fully stretched out. Stretching out here as the play happens. And a power play on its way for the Wiserhood coming off is originally he said number two. There is no number two for the Ducks for tripping. Number six blasting that again, trying to get his second goal of the game. Number six controlling that ball. Wizard with that man advantage. Shooting, missing wide. Wizard keep that ball. A minute and 15 seconds left in this power play. That one stopped, not cleared out. Defenseman just too big gets up on the ladder to grab that. Wiserhood in full control right now on this power play. The Ducks penalty kill. Forces them to have to retreat to get back on side. And a great pocket pick there by the Ducks forward for an opportunity to get out and change, and what a body laid. That was a forceful check by the Ducks player. Weiser head back on the attack here. Shot from deep, missed, and ball's cleared. And it looks like a potential icing as the power play ended. The AI camera unable to pick up the play. Now it does. 
Great movement by the goaltender of the Ducks. Ruben Boussier. As that first goal probably caught him off guard. 30 seconds in, a shot in from deep. Gets the better of him. Weiser get control. Ball flicked in deep. Race to the corner. And back the other way. The Ducks. Great touch there by that forward. Back pass flick. Camera can't keep up with the play. The Wiserhood is just too fast for this camera right now. And the Ducks getting control, throwing that in deep. for what is potentially a icing call. Yes, it is. Or, I guess, in this case, flooring. Ducks mount the offense here. Justin Flett dumping that in. Ducks trying to get control. They do down low. Backhand shot up high. Flett buying time. The Ducks swarming. What a great block shot by the Wiserhead player there. Diving, dropping. Looks like it did sting a little bit. Rink wide shot. And that will be another flooring call, this time in favor of the Oakville Ducks. Wiserhood just wanting to get that ball out of their zone to be able to get a change as the Ducks put the pressure on. On high. And stoppage of play here.
Great dangles by the Wiseheart. A diving body by the Ducks to try to stop that. And it looks like he potentially has. Fast pace action back and forth here. Backhand shot, try, trying to center that. No luck. The Ducks try to break out. Great defensive effort, avoiding that potential penalty as well. 57 brings that in, tipped up front, stopped and out. Losing his balance, one of the Ducks. Wiser trying to counter. Great defensive play by the Ducks defenseman to dive and prevent anything from scoring into that yawning net. Frank wide pass to the weak side. And losing track of the play. There's the camera. But there's also a stoppage in play, and it looks like we'll have ourselves a face-off. Outside of the Ducks defensive zone. Quick shot. Stopped by Boussier. Not allowing a rebound. Ducks show some speed and a quick stop by the Wiserhood goalie. That's either Kamal Deep Kangura or Sunny Soroya. As I don't have a number to know who's a net. But those are the goalies posted on their roster. Wazer Hood looked to break here. Ducks thwart that. Break up the right wing. Stop. Shoots. Saved by Boussier and a little festivities in front of their goalie. As maybe a couple of extra pokes trying to get that ball loose. If the clock is accurate, I know last game it wasn't really the most accurate. Uh, we have under 30 seconds left in the first period. Weiserhood up one to nothing versus the Oakville Ducks. This is Wiserhood's tournament debut here. And actually looks more like there's about a minute and 30 seconds potentially as the scoreboard at the top gets a little of. And we lose track of the play once again.
Wazza Hood control that ball. Try to break out here. Ball blasted in. Dump no chase. Number six, the goal scorer. Takes the shot, passes it down deep. Centered. Missing wide. Gets his own rebound. Tries to evade the Ducks defense. Great diving effort by number 28 of the Ducks. That is Kyle Thomas. Not allowing Wiser to get comfortable. Slap shot from deep. Boussier deflects that out wide. And a great no-look pass turned around. Shoots missing wide and... That is the end of period one. Wiser Hood up one to nothing on the goal by number six. We will be back after this. Welcome back as period two is about to get underway here in Edmonton, Alberta. As the Canadian Ball Hockey Association Nationals brings in the excitement. Wiser Hood up one to nothing on the Oakville Ducks on a 30-second goal by number six. Quick back pass. The Ducks. Unable to capitalize there. Able to break the wider hood. Break. That was counterintuitive English, but it makes sense. It made sense in my head, and hopefully it makes sense to you. As the Ducks look to keep the pressure up down by a goal here. Shoots. I assume no goal. The camera has lost the angle. Wildshot on the break there. A give no go and then a dump in. And personnel change for Wildshot. Give and go just behind him. That pass back to the blue line. Finds his target. Then he cuts all the way in around the net. Cover, 
Shoots wide. Boussier was ready for that one and ready as he sprung into action for a potential shot off of the rebound. Uh, stop at your play. Folks, I do broadcasting a little bit different. I like to interact with the fans. You can reach out to me on Instagram at Mr. Hamid, M I S T E R dot H A M E D. Let me know what I'm missing. If I'm mispronouncing names, if you know the numbers as a number, something from the Wazerhood. I can't see the black on black. Gorgeous jerseys, but the number design needs to be a little bit better. And the Ducks pushing and pressuring. Bad break there as one of their players tried to cut in. Goalie out of the crease to make a play and it's always dangerous here. That one put in deep around the boards. Picked up in the left corner. Hood now moving forward. Tough pass by the Ducks, number 40. Grant that I don't have a 40. Oh, I saw that as a zero there. Lazarus shoots, misses wide. And ball cleared by the Ducks for flooring to get the face off into their zone. Game is still. One nothing to the Wiserhood. The goal thirty seconds in. Defensive zone face off win by the Ducks and ball cleared out. And her goalie out of his crease deep. Able to strut back in. Wazer on the break. Great move there. And then gets stopped. As that ball is pinned on the boards and it breaks out in Wazerhood's favor. Number seven, shoot, scores! Top right corner to give Weiserhood a 2-0 lead. About 10 minutes into period number two, 
My goodness, what a shot from the lefty. Absolutely top shelf cheddar right there. I wish I had a replay for you folks. Wazerhood looked to keep adding it on. That one coming in. Diving. And Boussier standing at his ground. Wazer well, just swarming that ball every which way, looking to add on to this two to nothing lead here. This is their first game of the tournament. Sorry. Yes, it is their first game of the tournament. And another goal there. To get a three to nothing lead. I missed the number. If you know who scored, reach out to me on Instagram at Mr. Hamid, M I S T E R dot H A M E D, and let me know. As I enjoy interacting with the fans. And a face off win by Wazerhood. Throws that ball deep. Shot from the outside. And it looks like we have stoppage in play. I'm just noticing that I believe some of the players for Wazard have their names on the back of the jerseys, while others don't. which will make things a little bit better, but equally tough for me. The only one I've gotten so far is number nine is Nevjit Dami. Great play by number 88 for the Ducks, Ryan Simotion. To bring that ball down. Just has to make a play in the front there. Oh, look. Number 13 coming around. Leaves it off. A little bit of give and go action potential there. Required pass almost broken up. Coming into the play hot is number nine for the Ducks. Daniel Raftis is looking to get something there to potentially help the Ducks mount an offense. I need the camera to go back left say that because if it's listening to me they'll be able to pick things up stoppage and play
And we have slashing call here. Number four for Weiserhood. Once again, I don't have a name for him. And the Ducks look to get on the power play and get on the board. Weiserhood with a strong defensive zone faceoff win and able to clear that ball deep. And the Ducks having a hard time here. Getting into an offensive groove, a quick touch and shot. Tried to get cleared out by the goalie, no luck. And great job by number 13, keeping that ball on side. Shoots, trickles behind him. And now the Ducks look like they're in the groove of things. And another ball cleared out. And it looked like that was a, based off of the score clock, a double minor for that slasher call as a long power play here for the Ducks. They would love to capitalize on it. Shot thrown up front. Defended well. All cleared out. Fresh legs coming in for Weiserhood. Forty-four with the slap shot. Blocked. Stop to play will bring the face off outside of Weiserhood's defensive zone. Ball thrown in deep, deflected up. Potential shorthanded opportunity here for Weiserhood. And that forces the Ducks goalie, Boussier, to stop the ball. And Weiserhood gets a face off in the Ducks zone and I think it's a timeout we hear called by the Ducks potentially draw up a play
And we'll have ourselves a face-off in the Ducks offensive zone here with a minute 14 left on the power play. Ball back to the blue line. Duck slap shot. Out wide and rebound. Controlled by the Ducks. Thrown to the weak side. Squeezing in. Quick deflection. Off the goalie sticking up. Ducks still have control of that ball. Thirty seconds left in this power play. Shoots, and that is a rough play by number ten, Patrick Enman, going for the ball, running over the Wiserhood goalie. I don't think there was any ill intent. As the goalie seems to be okay, and that's always a good sign. Stop at your play here. I can't say it's a TV timeout because it's not like we're running commercials. With under 30 seconds left, and it looks like it's about 3.30 on the clock. The Ducks down 3 to nothing here in the second period. Had several chances. And haven't been able to capitalize. Weiserhood on the break here. Shoots. Stopped by Boussier. Weiserhood. Another short-handed short opportunity. This one had more potential. A little bit of sweat 
our water to be wiped away here, ensuring player safety. Great job by the refing crew to recognize that. Ducks looking to attack here. Roger goalie behind the net makes the play around the board. And it works out in his favor as there's a three on two. Wide shot. Roger Hood, tic tac toe. Give me a goal. No. Uh, not necessarily give me a goal. It makes no difference to me. I just tried to entertain you with my words. Elijah Hood trying to break out again here. Pass down low and stopped by Boussier. Number 50 has been busy. Wiserhood able to control that ball. And then the Ducks able to get that back. Up the left, left side boards. Quick collision there. Wiserhood attacking, centering. And Boussier making the stop. Losing his helmet in the process. Nope. Helmet was still on. Well, I just thought he had just a massive beard and long hair. Deep pass. The Ducks pressing. Wiser Hood stays and stands strong. Pass up the middle. Lost track of it. Wiser Hood gets it back, it seems. Up to the outside. Ball dumped in deep. Shot stopped by the Wiserhood goalie. As the Ducks try to get themselves on the board, being down three to nothing here in the second period. Potential under 30 seconds to play. I don't know how accurate the clock is that you see and the clock that's at. the field
Face off for the Ducks. They're able to win that. Slap shot. Blocked. Shot again. Blocked again. And the goalie snagging that out of the air. Shot by the Ducks wide as they look to get something here to end the second period on a high note. Dying seconds. Shot by number seven. Deflected wide. Wiser had looked to counter really quick. And stopped by Boussier, not allowing them to get anything to build. It's been moved by the Wiser Hood forward, and that will do it for period two. Wiser Hood, three total unanswered goals, three in this, sorry, two in this period. The Oakville Ducks have a hill to climb once we return for period number three. Welcome back. Soby Hammond here live as things are about to get underway for period number three between the Oakville Ducks and the Wiserhood out of British Columbia for the Canadian Ball Hockey Association Nationals. We are in day number one. This is still pool play. Oakville played earlier today. Losing... 11 to 4 to the Sherwood Park Ball Hogs. Stoppage and play there. No changes needed. Early in the third period here. And the Ducks 
bring out to a potential three on two. However, great back checking by Weiserhood. Slap from the outside the line. Ducks at the rebound. That one tried to be squeezed in. Half spin move by the Weiserhood defenseman. Asking for a back to a weak side. However, great hands. By these Weiserhood players. The Ducks, though, come back and Weiserhood goalie glued to the side of that net. Not giving any space. Great battle here in front of the Weiserhood bench. Ducks come out with it. Quick shot. Deflected out. And the Wilder now look to go on to the attack. A great two-on-one, back and forth, tic-tac-toe. And Boussier poke checks that out. Shot out front and deflected off with the blocker. And then on the rebound is the Wiser Hood big man getting goal number four. See if I can get a number and potentially a name for you folks. And it just says Wiserhood, number seven. That's the second goal of the game, at least. I don't know if he got the third goal, as that one is still missing. Battle along the boards, and the Ducks player loses his stick. Four to nothing here, folks. As just over 12 minutes left in the third period and this game. And potentially another goal. Waiting for the signal from the ref. A little chatter between number 29 of the Ducks and a wiser heard player. You like to see your teammates standing up for each other, whether it's adult ball hockey, Stanley Cup playoffs or some WCBL action in baseball. Knowing that your teammates have your back, hopefully spark a little bit of fight. And a shot from a tight angle stopped by Boussier. Boussier staying busy, stopping another one there. Wadsford off of the faceoff.
I apologize for the radio silence as I was having some technical difficulties. But we're back. And the Ducks advance, get stopped. Rink wide pass. Unless we lose track of the play here. Yeah, it'll find it. Weiserhood forcing that ball out of the corner. The Ducks get it back and look to attack as diving body trying to get it into the zone. Unfortunately, the Weiserhood takes a shot out wide. Tried to play that rebound back, but great job by the defense. And then another blocked shot there to prevent a goal except it can't be denied for long as Wiser Hood scores again for the fifth time this game. It is five to nothing. For the team out of British Columbia. And they just kept on pressing until they got the result that they wanted. Another close call there. Ducks looking to control things. A quick shot. Boussier looks tired right now. And I believe only one goalie on the roster for the Ducks. It will be a long tournament for number 50. And a quick break here by Weiserhood. Another steal. Dangles, shoots, misses wide. And the Ducks on the blue line looking to mount any form of attack here. But whenever a Duck gets the ball, you see one, two, three Wiserhood players on it. And then just sloppy passing from the Ducks will be a flooring call and a face-off coming inside of the Ducks defensive zone. You see Boussier there keeled over, trying to catch his breath. Something going on here. There's a conversation happening between the refs and the Ducks bench. Shh. 
Quick hydration for number 5-0. Action about to get started again here. Uh, the Ducks win that faceoff in their defensive zone. And another icing call as Ducks player unable to beat out the Wiserhood runner. Great effort. By number nine, Daniel Raftis, though. Tremendous hustle and heart. Ducks come away with that one. Raftis shoots wide. Rebound the Ducks. Try to get something here. Down by five goals. Under 10 minutes to play. And Boussier getting another stop. Putting another face off. Having a tough time getting it out of the zone, though, without causing that foreign call. A great attempt there to pick it off. And now he gets it. Tough pass. In tight with an unlucky bounce. Tipping that ball in deep. Little thing on a shot redirected by the Wajahood goalie. Up the right field, sorry, up the right boards. Number 17, Dangle shoots. That was a tight angle for Jamie Halster. Ball thrown in by Logan Halster, where I'm going to assume they're related somehow. Potentially brothers. Saucer pass, missing the mark, gets it back, shoots. Great defense by the Ducks, playing their body on the line as that one sails over the intended target. Shot. 
missing wide. David Scott Enright with a bomb that just couldn't find the, the zone that he needed it to. And a potential flooring call here. Control on that. Played in front of the Ducks bench. Shot. Scores. What an absolute one timing blast. And Bouzier. As tired as he is, that was going to be a hard one to stop. And I believe that was a number two with the goal potentially. Six to nothing for Wiser Hood. Under five minutes left in the third period. A shot by the Ducks. Wiser Hood attacking. Boussier with a stop. And the Ducks want a counter here. But tired legs all around. And a delay penalty coming up. As I believe that is number six. I don't know if the call will be roughing there. I know he... Uh, Pretty aggressive with that check. Number six started the goal scoring streak here. For Wiserhood with a goal 30 seconds in into the first period. Ducks setting things up. Stopped and then cleared by Wiserhood. Four man wall. Ball deflected. Wiserhood. Forcing the attack. Boussier coming way out of his crease to stop that. That was a scary two on O, oh, but Ruben Boussier. Absolutely tremendous effort from the Tendi to keep fighting. The Ducks shots just hitting bodies, not finding the zone. Two on one here, short handed. Delay penalty frustration kicking in for the Ducks. Maybe not a delay penalty. Potential offside instead.
seems to be the case. I believe the clock on the screen doesn't align with the clock at the field. And face off outside the Ducks defensive zone. Wiser Hood gets control of that short handed. And they just look to kill some time here, bringing it all the way back into their corner. Off the wall. Too fast for the camera to keep up. And a tremendous effort by the Wiser Hood offensive player keeping that ball on his stick. Wiser going for it. No tripping call there. Extra curricular is behind the play. Stoppage and play here as potentially another power play. Cross checking by, I think he signaled number four, but even if I knew the number, I don't know how much it would help. Well, looks like there's just under four minutes left to play now that the time has been adjusted. As the Ducks are down five to nothing, shoots. Ball bouncing around near the Wiser Hood net. Another shot. To no avail. Shooting that one wide, bouncing. The Ducks trying to force anything their way. And a face-off into the Ducks offensive zone. Ducks trying to get in. And Wiser Hood's four-man wall denies entry. Sending that ball back. Ball in deep. Ooh. 
Link wide path to try to get potential deflection. Wilder trying to clear it. No luck. Number 17, Jamie Halster. Trying to get that in and stoppage and play here. As potentially another penalty. High stick by the Wiserhood player. And we have ourselves a five on three for the Oakville Ducks. Slap shot right off the bat. Stopped by the goalie, directed wide. And that ball cleared deep. The Ducks looking to stay fighting here on that five on three. Another shot stopped, deflected. Ducks still have control of it. And that ball deflected. But to no avail as the game has ended. Wiserhood shut out the Oakfield Ducks who dropped their second game of the day and that of the tournament. Wiserhood scored five goals. First one coming in by number six, 30 seconds into the game. And then number seven scoring two goals in the second period. What? Sorry. It